Okay, this is my fourth attempt trying to make this video. I tried twice with the GoPro uh, when I was actually doing the test. And each time it wasn't on. But anyway, I'm going to explain to you what happened. And, you know, I would say, you know, try this out for yourself. But I would, really wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> uh, what I did was I took um, uh, just a regular HPA. And I was at about... 1500 PSI on this uh, tank and it's regulated at a thousand PSI so I had plenty of air for what I wanted to do and it took uh, three shots at this phone book down here on the right side of it and I'll go through that in just a minute and then what I did was I drained the tank and I filled it up with 2,000 pounds of helium. And I did that uh, with this makeshift device. It wasn't any good anymore, my wife said. Uh, and what I did was I just uh, you know, took a plug out here and screwed my uh, fill whip up to it. <coughs> Excuse me, fellas. I made a lot of dust setting up for this. <coughs> and it, it works just fine. I mean, I, I filled up my tank. I got 2,000 PSI in it, which is, you know, what this one was saying it was. Um, and then I was able to just bleed it off by uh, you know, uh, bending this uh, balloon filler after I tightened it back down. Anyway... What I have in here is 2,000 PSI of helium. And now I'm going to show you the results. They weren't kidding about this stuff. This is nuts. This is absolutely nuts. All right, this is going to be kind of hard to do. Uh, let's see. For the uh, 1,000 PSI HPA on the... Uh, right side we got penetration let's see where the BB is okay we see the BB there at page 170, 117 and I did two more this was the first time I shot the helium that I thought I was recording and then here here and here the second time I thought I was recording. And this is nuts. Okay, there it just fell out at 323, but you can see right there and right there. And then over here where the HPA was, there's nothing. We still got good penetration right in there. As we go up further, the pages are more compressed, so you see less and less. But I can see right, I can see that, and then that shot, and then of course there's nothing over here where there should be one. And then I'm seeing my two lower shots visible here, you know, at page 323. So that's more than double what the HPA did. The second shot, there it is. Right there, and we're at page 275. And there's where the second uh, shot about on that level was. But it's further up, more compacted. And over here, there's nothing where we had the HPA. And... Wait, there went, there went another shot somewhere on. Well, there's our second shot right there at page 275 it's visible and I'm seeing one right here another helium shot right there in the middle at page 237 and then there's nothing 
nothing over here on this side for the HPA. There's still nothing over here. Still nothing over here at 217. And I'm seeing all six of these rounds over here. Okay, we're starting to see the HPA coming in at 199 where it uh, broke the paper. Whoa. Okay, and there we see this one probably, it was the most compact part of the phone book. And that's a helium shot. And I'm seeing it poking through at 156. So there it is right there. 134. So. And, a, and there, that's the. Where the phone book was compressed the tightest. And it went through further. Than the HPA shot at the least dense part of the phone book. So I'm gonna go ahead and shoot it for you. Those of you who know what uh, a Blackbird shooting uh, 1600 PSI with a um, tactical barrel um, this is louder than that it's a good bit louder than that I don't know what kind of uh, feet per second I'm getting off of this thing but it's got to be at well over a thousand all right uh, I'm gonna shoot between the center column of where the helium shots were and I'm gonna put one round way up high right up there near the spine of the phone book see what that does and then one in the middle and then one way down low listen to this that thing is loud This is nuts, guys. I mean, you didn't even see the phone book move. But there we have one right there. It's up near the spine. And then here's my second shot. And then here's my third shot way down low. Let's see how far the... That's about how compressed the phone book is. Let's see where the one way down low went. Starting to see indentations at, you know, 500. It's somewhere around 500. Hang on, let me set this down. Yeah, the indentation is visible up to page 493, right there. Hang on, I'm going to set you down again. And there's the BB at page 402. And there it is, it's rolling out at 397. Alright, next up... I'm seeing that one. 
right right there at page 350 Let's see I'm seeing it poking through at 298 And there it is, 275 to 298. Let's see what the other one did. Oh, we just had one roll out. Yeah, near the spine, I'm getting good indentation at 116. Hang on, let me put it down. And I'm seeing it poking through there at 56. And guys, that's right next to the spine of this thing. This is incredible. Here we have the HPA shot visible uh, further down than mid length on the page. At page 57. So. I mean, this is incredible how strong this helium's doing it. I mean, this is nuts. Oh! Huh. Let's see what a little full auto will do. Go up to 2,000 rounds a minute. Why not? We're gonna cut the cut the pulse back to seven, though. Let's see. Safety first. Good grief, my ears are ringing. <clears throat> Man. <laughs> this thing's just full of babies now. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> The carnage. <laughs> oh, jeez. I mean, even down here. Oh, man. <laughs> Babies everywhere. Well, uh, I guess that, you know, that's, that's your proof right there. This, I wish I had a chronograph, folks. Um... That's definitely next on my list. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. And, yeah, so, that's awesome. I think I'm going to go play now. Later.